Hi, this is Cooper. Uh, these are the picks I found this week. Uh, first off, I have this um, Dreamcast joystick. And as memory, there's actually underneath it in the basket, there's joysticks, power supplies, more memory cards, uh, all that for $2. I bought this uh, vintage lamp. I just like it. It looks such a Art Deco look on it. And uh, this was $5. I mean, it's no scratches or anything on it. Well preserved. Then I bought... Uh, this is a letter tray for a desk. It's uh, by a designer, Peter Pepper. It's not in the best shape. And I don't really know what I can get for it, but I only paid a dollar. Figures. Should get at least 20 to 25 dollars. Maybe not that much. Anything, you know, a dollar is a good price. Then another grab sale about this, this telephone uh, connector or something. Uh, that was a dollar. And I bought these, uh, old ceramic doorknobs. The doorknobs with the lock. And this, uh, antique egg beater, which is in great shape. And that was ten dollars for the, those three things. And I got this, uh, Lustroware canister set. They're all in there. Nice, no cracks. Uh, it's a dollar for that set. They, they, they may bring about twenty dollars on eBay. This uh, Rawlings catcher's mitt. I'll list this in the spring. But uh, it's a Johnny Bench model. Paid five dollars for it. It should still bring twenty to twenty-five dollars. A tin pack of uh, DVDs, unopened for a dollar. Starbucks coffee cup for 25 cents. It's a Star Trek collectible glass, and that was only 25 cents. And where I got that, this gentleman had this uh, clock here. It's a uh, Marion K. Uh, numismatic clock, made 1968. It's brushed aluminum. And I was looking at it. He only had 25 cent price tag on it. I was looking at it, and he says, "Oh, there's a screw missing right there." He says you can have it for free. Well, I can't find one on eBay, but other Marion K. Numismatic clocks. There's only a couple listed on eBay and. They're buy it now. Is one of them one of them's three hundred and twenty dollars, and the other one's like two hundred and twenty-five dollars. I don't think this will bring anything close to that, but gosh, it's it's a should bring a nice price anyway for free. Just uh, those circles you see, you just put the coins in there. They had half dollars, quarters, dimes. Uh, then I bought these. Uh, <coughs> It's uh, chrome, it's paper towel, wax paper, and aluminum foil holder. And it's also in great shape. It's from the 60s. It's a Lincoln... Of course, it's written backwards on there. I already forgot the name. <coughs> but I bought that with a uh, companion piece here. Which I don't know if you can see it all that well, but it's got the tea, sugar, coffee, and flour. We tip out. Things open up. Both pieces for five dollars. I think it's just a nice '60s look. I got this uh, Brookstone boogie board. Never saw one before. You just write notes. It's uh, electronic. 
right with your fingertip or whatever. Just press erase and it's gone. It's cool. It's only two dollars. Got a Skyscan atomic clock for three dollars. Got these uh, play settings. The sun's starting to shine through now. I'm going to adjust the uh, blinds. Uh, here, Christmas card play settings. And there's eight in each box. It's two boxes for leave a dollar each. Those are bring uh, ten to fifteen dollars a piece on uh, eBay. I thought this was a nice piece. It's nicely clean. It's a dictaphone recorder. It's a cassette tape, leather case. Only paid a dollar for it, but they only bring about five dollars. Then I have um, got these uh, Sylvania Magic Cubes for 50 cents unused. There's three of them in there. Got this uh, Nintendo DS uh, Art Academy. It's unopened. These go for uh, new on Amazon for uh, $23. And I got a book for a quarter. This book was like three dollars, but new and used on Amazon, sixteen fifty. A book I want to read, David McCullough, seventeen seventy six. And I got like uh, five of these Gun Trader Gun Digest books, modern guns, dollar piece. Those should bring five dollars or so a piece on eBay. That's uh, basically what I got this week. Well, take care. Hope you're not snowed in. Bye.